a certain amount should be distributed in some ratio 2 3 4 but there was a mistake and it, it got distributed in what ratio 7 is to 2 is to 5 because of this we got 40 less Two is to three is to four is the actual ratio, and what's the wrong ratio? Seven is to two is to five. Because the question is talking about the difference in these amount, let's work on B. Let us assume that the total amount is T. The total amount which has to be distributed is T, which is same in both the cases. Total amount is actually two is to three is to four ratio distribution, but it got distributed in seven is to two is to five. If you observe in this, how much should be B? B should be equal to three parts out of nine parts. Yes or no? 3 out of 9 into total. This will give me B's value. B's actual value. In this case, what happened? What is B? B dash. This is erroneous value, right? Wrong value of B. B got 2 parts out of uh, 7 to 9 and 5, 14. 7 out of 14 into T. Total amount is total amount in both the cases. It, it does not get changed. So, actual value of B should be 3 by 9 of T, which is nothing but 1 third or T by 3, I can say. You know, this goes 3 times. And here, this goes 7 times. So, this can be taken as T by 7. So, actually B should get T by 3, but B got T by 7 and because of which uh, the difference is 40 rupees. B has got 40 rupees less. So, I can say T by 3 minus T by 7 equals to 40. Solve this and you will get the value of T. So, 7 T minus 3 T, 4 T by 21. 4 T by 21 equals to 40. It goes 10 times. See, again understand, I am cancelling, it goes 10 times. It goes 10 times. But this is not required in the exam. In the exam, by the time you write this, you must be able to understand 10, 21, so 10 into 21, 210. You don't actually have to cancel. Understand, this action will take some time. Second cancellation will take some time, right? So, maybe I am doing it here, but when you solve it by yourself, try to cut down. This is important. You may find, you may feel that how much time does it take? It takes only half a second. But then, that's precious. Every second counts. Time is like gold there, right? So, if you have written 40 by 21 equals to 40, Without writing anything else, you must be able to calculate, okay, 10 times or 210, 21 into 10 is 210, right? Don't do all this drama in the exam, you are not going to get more marks for that. So, T will be equal to 10 into 21. Now, this is a waste of time. If you ask me 10 into 21, why should I write? I don't have to write. I am writing so that you can follow it clearly. But when you do it by yourself, cut it down, right? So, 10 into 21, 210. I should not even write 210. Why should I write 210? I know 10 into 21 is 210. I am wasting my time in writing 210. All of you write 210, see how much time it takes at least one second. However fast you write, right to 10, to 10. It takes one second. That second is lost. You have lost one second in just writing the number and that doesn't help you anyway, right? What is the answer is important. Whether you write it on paper or do it mentally or copy it from someone else does not matter. Finally, you will get one mark if your answer is that. So, keep this in mind. Cut down the number of steps, right? I may be making it lengthy and I generally do this so that you all can follow easily. But as such, all the steps are not required. If you are smart, you will only write this part. You will not write all these steps. T by 3 minus T by 7 equals to 14, then do the step.